Is reality just an illusion? Is everything we see, hear, taste, or smell just a product of our imagination? Some scientists think so. I'm curious, John, and I want to find out why. The answer lies in evolution. Under classical evolution theory, humans are very good at detecting reality very accurately. It goes like this. Imagine a group of monkeys. Some of those monkeys are very good at finding food and others not so good. The ones who are good at finding food live longer, healthier, and have more babies. The ones that are not good at finding food, not so much. As generation after generation passes, the ones who are not good at finding food die off and all the monkeys end up being good at finding food. For a long time, scientists have believed the same thing is true for humans. Humans that are good at perceiving reality accurately survive better than those that don't, until eventually all humans are very good at accurately perceiving reality. It's a process that scientists believe has led us to have accurate vision, touch, smell, sight, and a good understanding of the world around us. But some scientists challenge that idea. They say that survival doesn't mean we see things accurately. In fact, it might mean we see things very inaccurately and have no idea what the world is actually like around us. These scientists say accuracy is not the best survival strategy. For example, heat represents a danger to humans and we see many hot things as red. These scientists say that it may not actually be red, our minds just create it as red because that's a color we can easily recognize and avoid. Evolution would have led those who see heat as red to survive better than those who don't. Over time, all humans would learn to see hot things as red. Red hot heat may have nothing to do with the true nature of reality. It may just be a result of evolution guiding us to safety. Take another example, the smell of rotting food. Maybe rotting food doesn't have that pungent smell. Maybe it's evolution that's created that smell in us to tell us to stay away from it. It's dangerous. What that means is that the world as we perceive it is created in our minds and not in the world itself. To make things even weirder, these scientists say there is no world separate from what we perceive. We can't separate some objective reality from what's created in our minds. That means we have no idea whatsoever what the world is really like except through our perception. So that begs the question, is reality as an entirety completely an illusion? That's a question no one can answer. I'm Curious John, and if you like what I'm doing on this little YouTube channel, please subscribe. And as always, thanks for stopping by.